uh, this year's uh, final at uh, Zerin Dam. Uh, this is the final of the Cup Masters uh, Championships. Uh, we've run a series of qualifiers around the country uh, from uh, Gauteng, Northwest, um, down in KZN. Um, and here we are with uh, the final field uh, to see who are going to be the, this year's champions. yesterday. Um, they came in at about 12 and they were able to see the swims for the first time. Um, so the field is out there now checking out uh, the hot spots and uh, which ones they actually uh, want to choose for the draw. And uh, yeah, let's see if it's a lucky draw and uh, they choose the right one uh, this afternoon. Tough because we caught the first fish. Because last year we sat and had two runs and we never got anything out, they got snagged up. So we're quite chuffed. And uh, for Team BFA, yes, uh, I think we're runners up now. <laughs> All right, we've come to the day of N1, morning day two. First fish landed on BFA swim. I'm well chuffed with the boys here, put in a lot of effort, a um, lot of camp set up all over. Guys are anxious a little bit on the first day. Uh, you can see the nervousness out on their boats, their feeding strategies. Um, I, I'm well chuffed with the first day. Um, we're looking forward to a better day today. There's been action on the banks last night, a lot of hippo. Uh, but yeah, let's wait and see what happens today. I'm hoping for big things. Okay, this is our first co-op of the session for the Tsunin Co-op Classic 2012. Uh, we fished it near to uh, some snags over on the other side, caught on double tigers. Really, really awesome. Now you come, you prepare so hard for this, you look forward to it, and when it goes, oh, it's absolutely fantastic. If they got for something like this, but <laughs> Second, so almost last to draw. So we drew swim uh, seven, uh, four, sorry, in the Zanin specimen camp, um, which ordinarily is quite a good swim, I think. Um, we we haven't had a fish yet, that's why we're here, looking to redraw. And um, our session there, we felt we were pinned in. There's a lot of lines either side of us that we feel may have been a factor. Um, the guy next to us had two carp, one really nice one, fishing very, very shallow in the margins, and that might be uh, you know, an aspect of, of what's actually working, not, not the deeper water, which, which we were used to fishing and used to catching in that spot, but this time, absolutely no. So we're gonna, we're gonna give it a go, we're gonna redraw and see if we can find somewhere where there's some margins, that's our game plan anyway. <laughs> Nothing to lose, so. <laughs> Just, um, it's a bit frustrating because we had fished there in the qualifier and did quite well, so we applied the same tactics, but then, Obviously, as Graham says, all the lines in and out the water and the activity obviously wasn't that good. So A lot of anglers in one tight area and noise lines, I think, put the fish off, I think. So yeah, we'll give it a go. Anyway, else, will sit for that camp. We might even draw it again. No, don't sit. <laughs> <laughs> 